the MGHS mid-sized SUV. More space, more safety tech with MG Pilot, and more peace of mind. All from only $29,990 drive away. The MGHS, it's the more you've been looking for. On air, online, and on your smart speaker. Autobahn Nakai, top gear, low prices. Hit News Briefing. Hello, Emma Griffiths with your national briefing. A cost of living package is set to be front and centre of tonight's federal budget. There's reports one-off cash payments will be handed down to low- and middle-income earners, while a cut to the fuel excise is also on the cards. The Finance Minister, Simon Birmingham, has told the ABC we might not see relief at the Bowser straight away. It won't quite take effect tonight because there is that process of passing laws, but we will make sure we do that as quickly as possible to give Australians that support, knowing that... It's hurting right now that around the kitchen table people are juggling uh, their budgets. Parts of Queensland and New South Wales remain on high alert for flooding for the second time this month. A man has died in Southern Downs while Lismore is being evacuated. Prime Minister Scott Morrison has told Parliament extra help is on hand. We are standing ready for any assistance. The Australian Defence Force is already going door to door to ensure the safety of residents. Emergency Management Australia, the National Recovery and Resilience Agency and the Australian Defence Forces are working with the state government to ensure every resources is available as always. While Sydney has recorded its wettest March in 80 years, the city copping a drenching with 509.4 millimetres of rain recorded, also making it the second wettest March since 1942. And actor Will Smith says he's a work in progress and he's now apologised to Chris Rock for slapping him on the Oscar stage. He's posted an apology on Instagram a day after stunning viewers around the world. The Hyundai Starry Alive is the van that is big on safety and big on tech. Available from 47.990 drive away for ABN holders. Take a tech drive today. In sport, Knights forward Mitch Barnett will plead guilty at the NRL judiciary this hour over a straight elbow that injured Penrith's Chris Smith. Although he'll defend his actions in a bid to reduce the penalty, arguing the hitch was careless but not deliberate. Meantime, Knights' Callum Ponga will return to the side for this Friday night's clash with the Cronulla Sharks. The fullback is returning from a minor knee injury, while Tyson Brizzle will line up for his 200th game. And the Bruntos have an Mackay and the wet Sundays today with a top of 32 degrees coming down to 20 degrees tonight. Tomorrow, similar conditions and 32 degrees. And our listener app is your new home of local news. Download the app now to listen live or on demand. <laughs>